Good evening and welcome to Grey Barn of Andover. Just want to show you tonight what's going on here. Snowing, but it's not supposed to stick. Tonight we are going to visit with our vendors. The head chick. And on second thought. On second thought specializes in painted furniture that she does. She upcycles a lot of furniture and she does have some smalls in her booth as well. The hip chick is vendor number 57 and she is a 30% off vendor items not marked firm. That 30% off is the same for cash or credit card. If you see anything in this video or any of our other videos or our Instagram or Facebook posts which have caught your eye, please do not hesitate to reach out to us. We are available well, I try not to be on it, you know, 24-7, but I will check your messages, your direct messages, as soon as I'm able to and confirm if an item is available or shippable. We do ship all over the United States. We are zip code 07821. You can get an idea if shipping will be worth it to you if you go to the official USPS website. At the top, there's a little toggle that you can hit, say, calculate a price. At that point, you put in your zip code and our zip code of 07821, and you can just click on the package and then put in the next page will take you to wait put in a wait just put in a few weights just to get an idea and that'll give you an idea of what the price will be uh, most of the time it is priority mail uh, we have found that though we are able to on some of the packages to also use parcel post so that might be an option as well because we found that in certain places that actually makes a difference so without further ado and i will go over again uh, within our our biography on our YouTube channel here at Grey Barn Antiques, you will find the links to our various social media sites. Instagram, we are Grey Period Barn, and Facebook is the same as the YouTube channel, Grey Barn Antiques, Grey with the E. So you can reach out that way or call us at 973-786-5555. Yes, that phone number is real. It is not from a TV show or a movie. We just had it across the street and we were able to keep it. So that is our landline and you can always email us as well. So you can see the hip chick has on this shelf a variety of different items and you are taking the 30% off the lowest item, uh, the lowest price, I'm sorry. So 80 and then you would take that would become 56. So 30 becomes 21, 90, 63 and all the way down. So her tags are quite detailed. She highlights the price in yellow. That doesn't mean anything other than here's my price so you can see it easily. There's a lot of a lot of times there's a lot of numbers and such on the tags. This way she's got it that it's differentiated. So that's our front room where the cases are. We just visited with the hip chick on her shelf there. Uh, don't mind the mess in here. We had a little party Sunday night and cleaned up most of it. We still have some things that we have to put away. I'm going to go and venture into on second thought now. And as I mentioned, she does a lot of upcycling of furniture. Things are on the floor that normally are not as one of her pieces got picked up late Sunday. It was a piece that I had featured on our Instagram and Facebook page and the people actually purchased it off of our Facebook page. So that had some stuff on it. So these bookshelves are for sale. I believe this one is. Maybe it's not. Oh yeah, there's the tag. Pretty great bookshelf. Upcycled. No measurements on this. So if you need the measurements, just reach out to us. We do ask that the vendors do put the measurements on the tags for this very reason so that you can see exactly what size it is. This is just $80 because it's 20% off and she does have the, she has a, looks like a transfer type thing on the back of it. So a very pretty little farmhouse bookcase here. This is a neat vintage bowl of fruit, $20 and they are wood, very cool, very MCM. And they're a teapot, very cute. And that is just $17.60. She is a 20% vendor. So now we're visiting with On Second Thought and you are to take 20% off the items not marked firm. So 50 becomes 40. Cute little shelf. Now I can't, my eyes are not that good to see the prices up there. So you're able to see them on the video and take the 20% off that if it doesn't have the word firm on it. Chandelier. And that is just 60, you can see. And always be sure to look up. She's got a lot of baskets hanging up on here and chairs on the wall. Let's try to make the best use of all the space. I see somebody pulled out the drawer and didn't put it back. It's always hard with one hand. This does sit flush. It's just people 
I call them drawer checkers. People that come in, I, I know they have no intention of purchasing furniture, but they have like this need to like open up every drawer in here. You can hear them going through. I watch them on the camera. So I just call them the drawer checkers. So this is unusual in that it's got the wallpaper on the front here as well. It's got this beautiful mirror. And I'm looking for a tag, which I'm not finding easily. Um, so I don't see it. So if that is something that is of interest to you, just let me know and I will get that information. Oh, there it is, it's on the mirror itself. And again, we don't have the measurements on that. So it's three and a quarter and take the 20% off. If you need the measurements, just reach out to us and we will get those for you. So you're taking the 20% off. 24 becomes 1920. It's a pretty nice little piece of porcelain. That's vintage. Nice wood mantle clock. That's just 52. I'm not sure if it works, but I do believe we have the key up front for this one. It is missing the little. No, it doesn't. No, it's not. It's got that right there. It's a beautiful clock. And there are tons of YouTube videos on getting those to work if it is not working. And also, if it is working, sometimes you, it will show you how to adjust. You can see all the springs and stuff in there to get it to work correctly. And it's a really beautiful old clock. It's got some nice age to it, a nice size, beautiful. So and you'll have seen a lot of these things on our Facebook and Instagram page as well. And on second thought, also has an Instagram and Facebook page that you can follow as well to see other pieces that she has currently and has done in the past. Boot Caddy is 24, and that's been upcycled as well. You can see she does a lot of these fun little pieces here, like this, this is a little cutting board, and then it's got the Scrabble tile holder on there, used as a cow, like a nice book holder, recipe holder, and it's got a lock there, so it's not going to tip over. It's got the built-in wood easel there, a pair of tables, Some canisters set down there. And we are visiting with On Second Thought at Gray Barn of Andover, where it is currently snowing, but I'm not too concerned. It's not supposed to stick, so driving will be fine. Donnie was dropped off at his Civil Air Patrol, his CAP meeting, and he's got his fatigues. They finally came. They, they actually are hand-me-downs from a U.S. Air Force cadet, so we had one of our vendors, Auntie's Attic, was kind enough to pull the the name in the U.S. Air Force off there. He's not supposed to, he can't have that on there because he's not with the Air Force. The Air Force does sponsor the Civil Air Patrol, but is a completely, as in, it implies, civilian Air Patrol, not actually part of the military branch. They are a strict volunteer organization that does all the search and rescue. It's very neat. If you have, and you could do it as an adult. You don't have to be just a kid to do it. As an adult, they are still looking for people to go up in the plane and help either taking photos or looking out if you have really you know with your binoculars if you're good at spying things helping in that way as well and finding unfortunately you know, they say not around here as much as out in like the rockies and stuff that they have to have that going on so here's these really cool i'm surprised these are still here because they're just 960 for the car carved book ends a little lightweight. I mean, they're not, they'll, they'll hold your books up. It's like a little cardinal carved into there. And that's for the pair, that 960. Nice old cupboard. Here we go. We do have the measurements on this one. And as is, it's just uh, normal age wear and tear on this guy. So 195, so it's 150 something. And this is strictly a, I'm sure there's a clasp or something that I just can't get my hand on right now. It's kind of hard when you got the, the one hand here with the camera. It's a nice little and table here. I will look at that a little closer. I just want to show you the baskets. And we are again visiting with our vendor on Second Thought, who specializes in upcycling furniture. So you can see right here our tag. So this guy is 60, and that does have the dimensions on it as well. This she did not do, obviously. This is a nice old MCM sewing stand. And that is 100 after the discount, and it's a Stroman Bach. So somewhere in here is the name on it. But this is a really, here we go. You can see that right there. Product of Norway. So this, a lot of the, this is probably teak. A lot of the MCM pieces 
that people desire the most are actually the teak out of Norway, Denmark, that whole area there. And this little basket underneath, I think. Yeah, so that can click in, or you can have it that it slides on open. And in the center, she did a really neat job. This comes with the game pieces. A nice gaming table. So you don't have to keep breaking out the, well, and there's also, here's this, this would be cute to leave on here as well, this nice little tic-tac-toe set. So 1440, and then you have the other game pieces. And look at how pretty this is. So that's a nice table. Look, you can store the game pieces right underneath it. And this is, again, I don't have the measurements. That's just $100 on that. Nice little tray down there for $17.60. This is a neat little caddy here for $24. And of course, there's this nice table here behind our gaming table. And that is, I'm not seeing the price, sorry. <laughs> like walking in circles. Here we go. And that one does have the measurement. So $95 becomes. It'd be 70 something so oh, this does not belong here so this belongs this the vendor code is in our upper left so this belongs over in Andover Junction we're gonna be heading over there momentarily um, this one is as is there's hairline inside of that so an old one probably didn't see it this set is 24 and this one is also 24 for the cup and saucer sets so now we're gonna go over to our vendor the hip chick who's vendor code 57 sorry I'm getting I'm passing Andover Junction so I'm trying to see if I can find oh I found where this plate goes there we go and again it doesn't have to be items from the vendors that we are featuring tonight if you see anything in passing let me know and you're of course more than welcome to find out and inquire about those items and of course purchase them so this is the hip chick step back so you can see she's got an eclectic mix of everything a lot of nice furniture this is the floor that I painted those are transfers underneath the paint so, it's a nice tea cart here the sides do open and this is a is this Thomas Miller no Drexel Drexel tea cart great price on that so check out how well she does the measurements she's got the clothes the open on there 180 and that is 30% off of that and it's in fantastic condition. It still has the liners in it. You have not just the Drexel on the side, but the Drexel on the silverware bag. And like I said, the sides do come up. It is on wheels. A little pinning on the wheels, nothing major. And of course, all the items on it are for sale, including the linens. And again, this is the Hip Chick, and she is a 30% off vendor. So this was recently reduced from 35 to 20, and then you have that 30% off, that makes that just $14. And she's not kidding when she says that is a heavy lid. So that's a nice stoneware crock there. So we have a few of these in the shop currently, but they unfortunately aren't in working condition. They're just very nice to look at. All kinds of milk bottles, collector's bottles, stoneware bottles, nice ginger beer stoneware bottle out of London. This is in fantastic shape. And there'd be your stamp right there. You can tell this is a nice older one there and that is a nice stoneware piece. So it's around $20 and some change. This actually still has the spoon with it in our Tom Turkey here. Nice condition. There's the tag. Let's see what we've got on here. Wow, that's just $14. A 1995 Bay Import China Turkey Soup Tureen, as is small chip on the top rim. So let's see. Is that on the lid of the room? Well, somewhere on here is a tiny chip. So she has priced that accordingly. And it's nice to see that it actually still has the, uh, the ladle. A lot of times they don't have that piece in there. So many of our visitors, our visitors, our vendors will revisit their booths and do these markdowns. So this was 39, this is now 25, and then with our 30% off, that's just 17.50 for this really nice anchor hawking fleur-de-lis chip and dip set. So you see how nice that is. 
lot of times you'll see just like a random bowl like this sitting around without this attachment you're you're out on your dip and what's nice is you just put this out just like this and have your dip in there it's still usable i do recommend hand washing i would not put this in the dishwasher because you can see a lot of this is going to come off and obviously you cannot put this in the microwave so make sure your dip if you're putting out a warm dip is preheated elsewhere before you put it in there this is nice this is just 1750 for the vintage aluminum bread box neat little horn here and like i said she has very detailed this is cracks and metal top very detailed descriptions so you can always be sure you know what you're getting uh, if you we do keep the tags so if you need that information we do recommend that you take a picture of the tag if there's a lot of details on it we put as much as we can onto the receipt so that you have that information on the item but if you need a little more detail feel free to take a picture of the tag first uh, these are nice glasses here Lovely entertaining, 18 for the five, and then 30% off of that. Oh, here's a nice tray. And she's even got the measurements on that. That's just awesome. Like I said, you gotta look down. Now this just, she just brought this in. Structurally sound, little cosmetic issues going on, which is why it is just $35. And here's the measurements on this cute little cabinet, white and gold painted, uh, has defective hinge bottom on the door. So it's, it's set that it's, it's sitting right for now, but for $35, it's a great little extra piece of furniture. Uh, you could probably strip that down and fix that hinge and make that really nice once more, or just leave it as is. The shabby chic look is always in, never goes out. This is a nice little shelf and it's just $21. It has the towel holder on it. It has a nice shelf there. And it's nice that many of the lights are plugged in so you can see that they actually work. This is 22 and then the 30% off of that. On off dimmer switch. Oh yeah, there you go, right there. Yeah, nice and easy that is. And it's got this really cool vintage style bulb in there. So that alone is worth a little bit more than you know so you're getting the whole light fixture with it a very funky little light fixture there for you always a great assortment of candelabras in here and these are each there's two available at 28 and then you're 30 percent off you can see she's got two matching ones there they look to be i can't quite see it's like brass with like a pewter wash over it it looks like and then this is just 40 for this cute so this becomes 28 for this little corner cabinet shelf whatever um doesn't have hooks on it but you can easily put hooks on that if you want to hang that up you can see it stands beautifully on top of the bookcase that she has it on and of course the littles in it are for sale as well nice little mermaid i know mermaids are always collectible 18 and then 30 percent off on her 10 becomes seven here's another interesting shelf this one is just 21 dollars i don't know if that one has the measurements or not no but you can see I'll step back so you can see that shelf there. And again, if you need any more information, if you do require measurements on the shelvings that I just saw, just that I just showed, let me know. So this one has the measurements, 18 and 30% off. The little glass topped one with the ivy leaves on it. And that's 26 and 30% off, and that has the measurements on it. She's got a great eclectic mix of everything in here. A little scale marked down from 40 to 32 and then take our 30% off. That's a, I'm not even gonna, if you ever watch my Facebook Live, you know I do not do W's and R's together very well. So I try not to do them unless I really take my time. So this is just the stand. Wow, 11 becomes 770, tarnish too small. So this is just for the stand, for your champagne bucket stand, but it's just $7.70. It has those couple of cracks, but it still does the job. I mean, I wouldn't use this bucket in here. This one is 40 and then uh, the 30% off, so that becomes 28. But if you have, and we probably have some silver plated, I know we sold some recently. Even if you have like a just a little silver plated champagne, but it's a cute plant stand too. Again, $7.70, you cannot go wrong. 
for that really cool little silver plated stand that's in as is cute little reindeer here 1750 we've always got some nice afghans coming in just 21 dollars. that one's a 70 by 70 and this one is six foot by 64 inches and also just 21. so you have these two different colors in the afghans which we are in afghan season I want to have that covering up that pretty little plate. This probably was underneath it. I'm just going to put that up here for now. This is pretty cool. I can't believe this is still here. This has some good weight to it. I've had it off the wall before I've had it in my live, and that's 19 and then 30% off. And, of course, this light that's here is for sale. This is a nice old toll-style brass and tin lamp. It is a cream color with this beautiful gold leafing design on it and what's fun with this lamp I mean this is great in your kitchen or anywhere that you need to just kind of extend out the light over a table over your bed wherever and then you just whoop, whoop, goes right back in it's a nice accordion lamp which again not easy to do with the one hand and we have the way we have this hooked in and that's just $49 and I don't have any measurements on that but again I can easily get those for you just message us Again, you are visiting with Gray Barney Antiques of Andover, multi multiple vendor shop located up in Sussex County, New Jersey. That's exit 25 off of Route 80. Just head north up towards Newton. We are on the right-hand side. We are a 3,600 square foot building open all year round, Wednesday through Sundays. We do a lot of Facebook Lives. I do a weekly one on Wednesday nights uh, at 5.30 Eastern Standard Time. They run about a half an hour to 45 minutes featuring many of the items from our vendors. I try to grab the things that just came in that day. So before everybody else gets a chance, before the weekend hits, we try to give you guys first dibs on those items because they do tend to go quickly a lot of times. And the weekend is very busy here. So I try to help you guys get a jump on that weekend. And we also do a lot of vignettes and such. I've been sharing those onto our YouTube channel and they've been coming up as little shorts. So you can shop those shorts as well. Oh, that's a really good deal on this. If this doesn't sell overnight tonight, this is definitely going up front for tomorrow night. It is a copper looking, I don't know if it's real copper. She even has it as copper faux, but it's only $7. It just has that really great classic look to it. Here's a cool, I don't know, it's a cupcake stand or what it is, tree candy, candle ornament, cupcakes, etc. cetera, $17.50. Um, can't really hold that many things on it, but it's got great height, great look to it. It's really, really cool, it's a centerpiece. Uh, they do, I don't know, they still make those. I remember as a kid, my mom had those round candles that she had that only came out at Christmas. I remember they were very fancy little round candles. We did not like them. They just went on their special little stand. Uh, I do know, I'm pretty sure they still, I'm sure they make them still. And here we have a basket with a bunch of fruits for just $10.50. So you get this really cool uh, grapevine with, the, twi with the, the nice, this is all, look at how cool this is. This is all handcrafted. This is a real uh, twig or grapevine. The grapevine they use a lot of times because it's easier to bend when you wet it. And then you just kind of make your baskets that way. And it's got all this great, fun, vintage fruit alone is worth $17.50. And that's sitting on top of this really tiny little stool. But this is a great step stool for $6.30. And again, she does have those measurements on there. Now, these are great for little stackers, too. Uh, if you're doing displays and stuff or a child can stand on it, I do not recommend Anyone probably over 25 pounds to stand on that. This chair, I'm, I'm surprised, is still here. This is a fantastic chair. Take these things off of it so you can see. It is super sturdy. Very cool mission-style chair. And I know it's, there's the tag. I see it. That's all wood. And that is just 35. And again, we do have the measurements on that. So this is the hip chick, and as I mentioned earlier, vendor 57, that's just the number in the upper left-hand corner is the vendor code. Uh, that This way we can ring it in the register and it will pull up her 30% off. So you don't have to memorize who's got what discount. This shelf that everything is sitting on is also for sale. It does have a little bit of a, a lean to it and it's not very heavy weight. So well, it's just got some good weight to it. Um, it does have a slight lean, but nothing major. It, it's only 65 and then 30% off. Very nice metal stand with three shelves on it. 
and always look up. I did feature those cute little fruit candle holders. Now they are wood candle. These are just attached on here. If you look at just the candle holder, you don't have to keep that fruit on there, but you can. And it also gives you ideas to use. You can make these every season. You can change out what is on them. And the way they did this is they just, you can see the, the ribbon has the attachment on it. They used the wiring or whatever to put that on there. So easy to remove. Always a lot of lighting in the shop from all of our vendors. A lot of books. And again, you're taking 30% off of vendor 57, who is the hip chick. So we visited earlier with on second thought, who is a 20% off vendor. So this is a good deal. These three guys are just 14 and then you're, and they are the hull and then 30% 30, 30 off that 14. So if you have this set or you know somebody who does, even if they don't, I mean, it is just a finger hole. It's not a, it's not a full, you know, a couple of fingers in there to hold, but it's really, I think, what do they call those? D handles or C handles that are very cool. Cool. Again, if I went past anything and you want more information from any of our other vendors, like I said they're constantly coming in and restocking. We have a high overturn of items from people purchasing, but not a high overturn of vendors. Our vendors have been with us for quite a while. There's a bottle holder. It looks like it just told, okay, so I see it kind of funky little thing there. And we have a lot of great enamelware, but I do not recommend using the pieces that have any of the rust, the paint off like that showing. And because of that, at this point, it's just 630. They are adorable. If you have an old Hoosier, uh, you do need some of that great old enamelware in there as part of your display. And we also have the Hoosier shakers. We get the jars in. We had these young boys in last week. They were so much fun. The kids had off on, from school on Thursday and Friday. And these two boys came in. They were brothers, maybe 13 and 14. And they bought a bunch of the Hoosier jars and that. They were just into bottles. Their father let them just go pretty much and get whatever they wanted to. And they just had a blast. And it was great to see the young crowd being collectors as well. So again, if you saw anything in this booth or any of our other booths that I happened to pass by or any of our past videos, I do have things up from a year, two years ago. Sometimes those items are still available. But just check the date of what you're inquiring about. Uh, just so I have an idea of when you saw it, like, you know, in case, because I can kind of jog my memory a little bit and remember from when it was and where it was, it might still be here, so. Or we have something similar, might catch your fancy as well. So again, you visited with Gray Barn Antiques tonight. We are 134 Main Street, Andover, New Jersey. We are open all year round. Here are our hours, and you can shop us 24-7. And tomorrow night at 5.30 will be my weekly Facebook Live. And then this Sunday night, because this is where I film my Facebook Lives here, I put this up as a reminder to myself that it's this Sunday night is our monthly sale, which is the one that my husband hosts. So I hope you have a wonderful evening, and we will see you soon. Thank you.